a lot of players are doing this where they tech straight to a tier two unit or tier, you know, and then they transition into a lot of tier one, which is pretty cool, I think. So this Banshee's dancing around, taking out Marines. And, you know, the Vikings are a little late to the party, but there they go. And Vikings are shooting at each other. One Viking goes down. Ooh, another. Oh, each each lost a Viking there. So really close fights here between these air armies. And look, that point defense drone is still up. That's really. I didn't know it had such a long life. That's good insurance policy. But he wishes he had put it closer to his cliff. Hmm. Because, uh, you know, he's getting a little bit of harassment done. Two reactors, two tech labs on these four barracks. So he's going heavy, heavy infantry now, now that he has the expansion established, despite the harassment from QXC. Uh, medevac, one Viking, some marauders and a marine. Oh, not a marine. Many, many marines. Two bunkers going down outside the natural for QXC, and a raven comes up, because he's figuring it's about time for, for raven action. Uh, looks like uh, QXC is opting for more of the pure air army right now. Either that or he's a little bit behind. Um, those two bunkers do go down. That'll help a lot with this infantry. Good scouting. I like uh, the scouting from both players in this. They're much better than me. <laughs> They're aware of what's happening on the map the whole game, and it's a really tough part of the game for many players, including myself. So these Banshees are cloaked. They're going to take shots. No Raven for... Uh, so crates, but the scan does go down, and he committed a little bit too hard with those banshees. Uh, he kind of figured they're cloaked. He doesn't have a raven. I'm gonna get a lot of damage done, or maybe he just missed micro. But yeah, because of the scan, point defense drone goes down above these bunkers. The inevitable push is being anticipated. Two marines are shooting at really big rocks, and you know they're pretty depressed about that. I have to imagine. Just all right, private. And, Sergeant, you get over there and just shoot the crap out of this big rock for, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes. Tell me what happens. At ease, fall out, whatever the army says, I don't know. But yeah, their job sucks. Anyways, harassment up here at Planetary Fortress. Um, not many SCVs to repair this, so that is going to go down. It's relative ease. Uh, Vikings lift back up. And uh, our two buddies are still... <laughs> <laughs> Still doing their job over there. Um, this is why I didn't join the army, because they actually make you do that sort of crap. I'm serious. Um, I'm looking at a blank spot on the map. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Scan going down. I'm, uh, just checking out the uh, purple expansion there. Uh, Comsats should be team colored in replays. I know it's a subtle difference, but could could help with the uh, observers. Little suggestion. So these guys are going to come back here, recheck this expansion. Looks like Socrates is establishing his third base, and QXC is building his third command center in his main. Uh, he did have a third base established, but as we all recall, that got taken out. Here comes a big force coming down the, the ramp here. Point defense drone. Oh, another point defense drone goes down, and just. Really helping out with the Marauders, but they do not stop Marine shots. Just not enough. Um, the Marines were the big heroes there. And now the Marauders are free to focus on this command center. Cloaked Banshee's going down. Uh, trying to repair this, so he is down to one base. And uh, the Vikings aren't doing much, but these Marauders and Banshees are doing a little cleanup work. Big Air Force here for QXC. Um, he does manage to take out the remainders, but not without losing the command center first, so not looking good right now. A lot of SCVs in these expansions, that's great. Uh, two turrets going down. I I don't know. I kind of am like, at this point, these guys are making so many air units, it's going to take a lot more than two turrets to be effective, but that's a big resource investment, so. Here comes a purple force coming up the middle and pushing. Uh, looks like we got about five banshees and a handful of Vikings. Takes down the. No, he does not take down the turret. Um, those banshees are making very short work of that turret. So instead, he decides to take his rage out on this stupid barracks that did nothing. He's like, take that. 
Yeah. Leaves the tech lab, though, as a souvenir. Mm -mm. Lots of barracks for Socrates. I think I saw six. Yeah, six barracks, no add-ons on two of them. There's the raven, two ravens. And uh, here comes the, the air squad. I'd like to see Thors here. Um, Thors are really good against small air like that. Vikings are pretty good. I mean, well, Vikings are very good, but a Thor is very, very good. So, could make a huge difference. And yeah, here comes. For an area. Oh, he just saves the command center. Oh, why didn't he finish it? For an air unit, the Banshee does retarded amounts of damage. Like, it's almost unfair. And I. It is unfair. Because you know what? In TVT, I get Banshee harassed and I cry. So. It's unfair. Dear Blizzard. So here comes an Air Force. I'm just trying to fast forward because this game is so damn long, but there's never really a good spot, so I end up awkwardly pausing. Yeah, sorry about that. Marines. Oh, a lot of cloaked banshees. Uh, but the Vikings are... Big Viking battle going down. Oh, reinforcements for QXC. But the Vikings are still going to go down for him. However, though, ground force is going to be completely annihilated by these Banshees. He's forced to turn back. So they both, they simultaneously punched each other in the jaw there. And they both are pretty upset about it. <clears throat> 56 SCVs and 53 for QXC. 56 is more SCVs than I've made in all my combined games of StarCraft 2. So, yeah. <laughs> That's obviously not true, but you get the gist. Um, I actually played my 1,000th game of StarCraft II today. Uh, I had about 750 before the reset, and now I just got 250. That's including 2v2 and custom games. I, I kind of approximated, but... Yeah, 1,000 games of the beta, and I still suck. Here comes a force. Uh, another Viking battle. Uh, the Raven throws down a point defense drone. Whoa. Did you see that? That's called Plan A right there. Look at that. That is an efficient construction crew. Oh my god. So five turrets at Command Center going down at the Gold Minerals. And these guys can't really engage each other because their forces are so similar. Uh, purple, that would be QXC, has a superior air force, but Socrates has ground forces to complement his air force, so they end up kind of stalemating in these clashes which is pretty cool. One of them's going to need to, uh, you know, go tier 3. Otherwise, it's not going to be not going to be fun. Um, lots of turrets going down. He really wants vision of this area, which is, you know, perfectly understandable. Sees this, uh, yeah, I've had the gold expansion for a while. What up? Yeah, so he's like, damn, um, I really need to do something about this. And I s there's an armory... And there's a factory with a tech lab, and there's 600 minerals, and there's 1,600 gas. Why doesn't this guy have Thors? That's all I'm saying. That would make those Banshees look silly. Just silly. But, you know, hindsight's always 20-20. It's easy for the observer to know exactly what to do. Much different in the heat of battle. So just tons of starports. Lots of money for both these guys. This is going to be... Like I said, a long one. Here comes a big air force, Raven, a bunch of Vikings in the infantry. Uh, they decide to not engage. There's a Thor! Oh, I'm so happy. So happy. Let's see if it works out. Now I'll probably eat my words. It's going to suck. The Banshees are going to focus fire it. No Banshees here. This is a pure... Look at, look at the splash. Sahara, you were right. Man, one Thor made all the difference. Um, with uh, like, if he just control clicked all those SCVs and just right clicked the Thor with them and put them on auto repair, level three uh, air weapons going down for QXC and uh, two battle cruisers. By the way, um, but anyways, that Thor could really put a dent in that Banshee army. Two Thors could do even more. So here he goes here, he's going to uh, lay down siege on the outside of this guy's base. This marauder is just a little, a little overzealous, but turns out alright so far. 
moving up with his infantry. Uh, just trying to finish this command center. 